Is that the, is that the sun coming out? Is that, is that the sun? Is today the day? Today's the day. Today's the day. Am I scared? Am I scared? Am I happy? What am I? Oh, 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 the eclipse, oh, the totality of it all. Oh, all right, it's about 6 a.m. I want to be, oh my God, it's exactly 6 a.m. Okay, so today's the big day. Eclipse day 2024. The end of the earth as we know it. So some may fear, but it's just gonna be a really cool picture day. It's gonna be a fun day. All right, so viewing boxes. Got a couple good boxes here. This is the kind of box I saw in the video, one of these like fold in boxes, but I don't think it really matters as long as it's a decent size and you can get a good line on it. So I'm gonna figure out where I want the window here. And then I gotta kinda cut it out. So one side is gonna be the, the hole with the little poked hole in it. And the other side will be the paper and I'll have to have a window to view it. So I have to have a hole here, a hole here, and something taped in the back here. Same thing with this one. for the aluminum foil. Boom, that's all you need, little pinhole. Oh, I gotta make a viewing window. Alright. Bye bye. Bye bye. Mm, is it gonna work? No, it's just super cloudy. I think it'll work, it's just really, really cloudy right now, so because those storms just passed, but I think that'll do the trick. At the viewing window, the box will be set up. I'll be able to see inside this window as the light shines through that pinhole. And if something happens where that pinhole ain't, ain't good enough, I'll make another one, but I think that'll, that should work. So now I just gotta make one out of this one. Mm, this is a good spot, I guess. Okay. So I got whole hole. Won't need to cut out any more holes. And then I gotta put that white in the background. I get my white. Get white in there. Sticks. There. Sticks. And then I'll. Okay. All right, so now we have the boxes ready. You ready, bro? Maybe you, you ready to go glasses. see this? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Huh? Maybe you need to leave him a pair of sunglasses for this because he has the girls. Okay. Yeah. All right. 
I'll leave a pair here. Yeah, I don't even need a pair. As long as somebody around me has a pair and I can look at it, I'm fine. I want to look at it. I also have viewing boxes. These boxes right here are just kind of like the glasses. They take a little shine from the sun and you can see the moon coming over the, the, the thing inside the box. That's all you see with this really is the same thing. This thing is so darkened out. Like right now, when you look at the sun, go ahead. Have you looked at the sun yet? Look directly at the sun, Nick. Go ahead. Put them on first. Hey, sure, Rob. Yeah. You see that? How the sun just oh, looks okay. like a big white dot? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You'll just see the black moon the going right over it. Oh, yeah. Well, that's exactly what's at the back of my box. It's just a little smaller. All right. You ready to get out of here? Mm-hmm. All right. This is where we headed out. We left the area. It was a pretty long drive. It actually took us way longer than we wanted it to. I think everybody within 50 miles of the line was trying to get to it because that traffic, let me tell you, it wasn't normal. It was an animal of its own design. The solar eclipse traffic animal. It is real, folks. So let me, let me just warn you of that first. So the next time you want to go trotting along off to the old solar eclipse termination line, let me tell you, you're going to have a fun time getting there if you don't take a plane or something. Because it was rough. But we did get there. We had us a nice little trip. Oh, there's Corey fixing the mirror that Nick, uh, you know, uh, displaced for him. That's what we do here at, uh, at our job sometimes. We like to mess with each other. But uh, we really wanted to take the girls too, but they're kind of young. Three and two. Not even two. Three and almost two. But, uh, or three and, yeah, three and two. I, I don't know. What the hell? I'm the grandfather. What do I know about age? Anyway, they're, they're young. They're too young to know what's going on out there. So, uh, you know, we didn't bring them, but we did bring the boy. He had a great time. And let me tell you, folks, if you've never been to one and you get the chance to ever go, make sure you take it up because it was an unbelievable, unforgettable experience. And I really hope anybody that got out there was able to have a good time with it and maybe have some fun with some of the toys that you can make uh, while you're out here. I, I didn't get any video really of the, of that, but, uh, I did get a, a decent video of the eclipse and I'll show that here at the end. I will put it out separate by itself just so you guys can see it. It'll be on my Facebook, but yeah, we had a good time and, uh, we're heading out here and, uh, we're going to click it into some, uh, some nice, uh, music driving, uh, that's what people seem to enjoy. The last time I had my Seal Coat Nation videos going, uh, it was one of the things they enjoyed was just our little musical drives. Uh, so we're going to pop into that, and uh, we'll see you when we get there. All right.
All right, so we've made it here. We are at Cicerella's Fireworks LLC. Dean Road in 24, just outside of Erie. And I don't know if you guys can see this or not, probably not, but she's almost completely full. She's about three quarters of the way. Oh my gosh, you can see it. Dude, you can see it moving. Tell him take your glasses off. Oh my god. That is amazing. Incredible. That is amazing. <laughs> I'm telling you right now, on video, this does not give it justice. To see this and just open air. Oh, oh my goodness. It's over. That's it. That's it. All right, so that was our little adventure. We drove, it ended up being a little over two hours one way and then it was pretty quick coming home, but we got to see it. And I'm telling you right now, I'm addicted. I'm gonna have to go see another one somewhere. And I don't wanna wait 20 years, so maybe uh, we'll take a trip as a family and uh, make it a big thing, because it's definitely worth, I think, seeing the totality of it I mean I don't even think we were I mean, we were right on the line so I think if we would have been in another mile two miles it would have been even that much better but anyway I hope you enjoyed it Eclipse 2024 in the books see you next time